This video tutorial is a step-by-step -step walkthrough of some typical question styles that you will be encountering while taking a diagrammatic reasoning style psychometric test. We will look at questions that ask you to analyse two groups of similar symbols and decide whether a symbol belongs to either group A, group B or neither group based on the grouping rules. We have two sets of five boxes. Each box contains some shapes. We need to look at all the boxes across a set and identify any patterns and consistencies within the set. Then we must compare them with the other set and figure out which set the figure belongs to. Let's start with set A with the box on the far left. This figure, like all the figures here, contains four squares. One black in the bottom right corner, one striped in the top left corner and two white squares. The next figure contains one black in the top left corner, one striped in the bottom left, and two white squares. Continuing along the set, it appears as if the location of the striped white and black squares is hard to determine. There may indeed be no pattern. However, there is clearly a consistency. Each figure has one black square, one striped, and two white. Let's now look at set B, with the box on the far left. We can see the one black square in the top right corner, though there are two striped squares and only one white. Looking on to the next figure, the same rings true with only one black and one white square with two striped. It seems we found our consistency for this set also, namely one black and one white square with two striped. Finally, let's look at our question figure to see where it fits. It has two striped and two black squares. Given that neither set A nor set B has a pattern of black squares, we can say that this figure belongs to neither set A nor set B. Thank you for watching this video tutorial. We hope it's been helpful. Best of luck with your test practicing here at Assessment Day.